let's continue the program inside the main function I'm going to declare two integer type variable int item and choice here we use a do while loop do a pair of curly braces and then while inside this loop I'm going to write here printf press 1 for insert then printf press 2 for delete I'm going to copy it and paste here I'm going to write here press 3 for display and then press 4 for exit next I'm going to ask user to enter choice printf please enter your choice to read the user choice we use a scanf function scanf person d and m person choice here many options are available and you have to choose one of them for that I'm gonna use a switch statement switch choice now we will write the case condition case 1 here we perform the NQ operation printf enter the value of item then scanf person d and person item now we call here the NQ function NQ and we pass item as argument and then break in case 2 we perform dq operation item equal to dq the value returned by the dq function stored to the variable item next we check item is minus 1 or not if item not equal to minus 1 if item not equal to minus 1 then we print the deleted item printf person d is deleted and here we refer item then break in case 3 we call the display function display and then break now we write the condition for do while loop while choice not equal to 4 if you press any number except 4 then this loop will execute again but if you press 4 then exit from this program ok main function is completed now we write the nq dq and display function one by one first I'm going to write the nq function nq function doesn't return any value so its return type will be void and it takes an integer type parameter so I'm going to write here int item before in certain element we need to check either fee space is available there or not for that I'm going to write here if rare getter equal to size minus 1 if rare getter equal to size minus 1 then Q is full printf Q overflow insertion not possible else free space is available and we can insert an element now we check the index of front and rear if font and rear equal to minus 1 if font and rear both are minus 1 means q is empty for this case we set font and rear equal to 0 else we increment rare by 1 rare equal to rare plus 1 now we insert the item at rare index q rare equal to item next we print the inserted item printf person d is inserted 
and here we refer item okay nq function is completed next we write the dq function dq function returns an integer value so its return type will be int int dq here I am going to declare an integer type variable to hold the deleted item int value if q is empty then deletion is not possible so I am going to write the condition as if front equal to equal to minus 1 or font greater than rare if one of the condition is true we print q under flow print f q under flow deletion not possible and then return minus 1 else delete the font element and store to the variable value else value equal to q front then we increment font by 1 front equal to front plus 1 next we check here a special condition if front greater than rare then we set front and rare equal to minus 1 next we return value dq function is completed now we write the display function void display I am going to declare here an integer type variable int i next we check either q is empty or not if font equal to equal to minus 1 or font greater than rare then print f q is empty else we use here a for loop to print the q elements else for i equal to font i less equal to rare and then i plus plus then print f q of percent d equal to percent d and here we refer i and then q of i this i is for this percent d and this q of i is for this percent d our program is completed so what we do here first we write here some statement as global then we define the nq function then dq function next we define the display function and then we finally define the main function let's run the program compile and run i make some mistake here let's correct it f r o n t font now give here a new line let's run the program compile and run please enter your choice i want to insert an element so i'm going to enter one press enter enter the value of item i'm going to enter three and it shows you three is inserted i'm going to insert another element enter the value of item i'm going to enter seven 7 is inserted I'm going to insert another element 9 is inserted now we display the queue so I'm going to enter 3 3 is store at index 0 7 is store at index 1 and 9 is store at index 2 now we delete the element from the queue I'm going to enter 2 3 is deleted I'm going to delete another element 7 is deleted please enter your choice I'm, I'm going to enter 2 9 is deleted so all the three elements are deleted now if we try to delete another element it will show Q under flow let's see I'm going to enter 2 and it shows Q under flow deletion not possible now I'm going to press 4 to exit from this program this is it hope you understand if you like this video please share it and click on the like button on youtube